Welcome to Keebles. Keebles is a physics-based vehicle building puzzle game. And today we're going to take you through Keebles' basic gameplay and vehicle building mechanics. Let's begin. The goal in Keebles is to build a vehicle to carry the bubble, a fragile glass bubble which collects Keebles, safely to the end of each level. There are three Keebles per level to collect. Level 1 is pretty simple. We just need to build a basic vehicle to get us from the start of the level to the end. When we're ready, we can press the workshop button to enter the workshop, where we will see our bubble right in the center of the workshop grid. We can also see on the left hand side that we've been given four beams and two medium wheels with which to build our vehicle. Let's try to put something together. Let's grab some beams, attach them to the bubble, stretch them out, put a couple of wheels to that. And when we're ready, we can press go to see how that works. Immediately, we can see there's a problem with our vehicle. It's fallen to the ground and it's dragging along and it's not able to get up that hill. Let's go and fix that. The issue with our vehicle is that we haven't built a rigid structure. Each of these joints is a hinge. So to make a rigid structure, we need to build triangles. Let's press go. And the vehicle rolls along nicely. And we've picked up our first keyboard. We're getting up that hill nicely, picked up a second keyboard. Now it looks like we haven't built a tall enough vehicle to reach this final keyboard and we've missed it. But we have made it to the end safely. There are five stars to get per level. One for each keyboard, one for beating the time limit, and one for being under the resource limit. Every level also has a bonus time challenge. You can see we got the shiny blue badge for it. It's pretty easy to get for this level, but it does get more challenging later. Let's try and get that third keyboard. We obviously need to try and build a taller vehicle. Up the top left, we have a couple of selector buttons. The first allows us to select one object at a time. The second allows us to select and grab all objects attached to a node. Unfortunately, we can't simply stretch the vehicle to make it taller as the beams have a maximum length. We're going to have to come up with a different solution. So let's start from scratch with this one. Let's raise the bubble by building a structure under it. And let's go. Vehicles fall into a heap again, we have a problem. Let's have a look. There's our mistake. Our structure hasn't been properly braced. There we go. And our vehicle's rolling along nicely now. Climbing up the hill, going for our second keyboard. And this time it should be tall enough to reach our final keyboard. And it is. We've now collected all three keyboards, completed the level in under the time limit, and the resource limit, and got all five stars. Awesome. Let's take a look at a more advanced level. As you progress through the game, you will discover new wheels and gadgets to build vehicles with in order to solve more complex problems. Let's have a look at level 23. Level 23 looks like we've got a large tall hill slash mountain to get over. We've got a small uphill run or ramp and two keyboards to collect up the top there before we get to the end. We'll also want to be careful not to overshoot the end zone or we'll go over the cliff. Let's go into the workshop and see what we have. Now it looks like we've got more items to work with this time around. We've got 20 beams, we've got two small wheels, they're fast and light, lighter than the medium wheels we had before. We've also got two idle wheels which aren't driven wheels. They have no drive for power by themselves, but are lighter than the medium wheels, which can be handy. We've got two parachutes, We've got two small balloons, two large balloons, four puffers, 
and four rockets. Let's see what we can build with this. So I think we're going to need uh, rockets in order to lift our bubble up over that big hill to begin with. So let's build a structure to put some rockets in. I think we're going to need about three of them to do this. So let's put some triangles up. Let's place a rocket there. Let's rotate it and place it downwards. Let's place another rocket there. I also think we need some wheels, obviously, to roll to the end. So let's build a structure to hold the wheels. I picked the fast wheels over the medium or idle wheels because the fast wheels are particularly light and um, will make it easier for the um, for the rocket rockets to lift to lift the whole vehicle off the ground. Let's set. All right. Let's have a look and see what this does. There we go. Now, if you notice on the left top left of the screen, you'll see a health bar in blue there. That's the bubble's health bar. When that bar is depleted, the bubble does that. It breaks into tiny little pieces. We do have to be careful not to break the bubble. Let's go back and see if we can solve the problem that bubble breaking by giving it a parachute for a softer landing. So let's try that. Let's put a puffer in here perhaps to try to give us a bit more um, control or speed to the end. Let's see if that actually helps. across that hill. I think we're going to need to build in some rotation to this vehicle to try to get it moving to the right a bit more than it currently is. So let's take this rocket and give it less downward direction which will actually rotate the entire vehicle um, clockwise. Deploy the parachute early, spend less time in the air. If you pass to right the vehicle. Oh, just missed that last keyboard. But I did make it to the end in time. I've got my two keyboards, made it in the time limit, and made it in the resource limit. That's an excellent result. Four stars out of five. Now, getting five stars per level has been designed to be challenging, particularly on the later levels. We're gonna make you work hard to get that fifth star. Apart from the stars, each level also has a bonus time challenge. As you can see from the grayed out time challenge badge, this level has a time challenge of 13 seconds. Beating the time challenge often requires a completely different design strategy for your vehicle, and there's often more than one solution to the problem. Here's me showing off my design for my fastest time in this level today. I'm very proud of it. Well, that's it from me for now. Thanks for watching this video. We're working hard to release Keebles on as many platforms as we can, so please visit our website at www.keeblesgame.com to check out the latest news on the release for your particular platform. We hope you enjoy playing Keebles as much as we've enjoyed putting it together. Happy building! Hey, again. What the? Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Yeah. Yeah. Ouch. Easy does it. Two keyboards, three keyboards, yes! No! Aww. Buy the rockets. Hmm, need more rockets. Here comes the boulder. Stop. Parachute. Get the keyboard. Wait. Oh no! Ow! Go! 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 Go!
No, stop, 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 stop. Ah, ouch. 